hi welcome to the SQL server video tutorial in this video i'm going to show us how to get adventure works 2019 database into our microsoft sql server management studio so let's get started by the way in our management studio for now we can see that we have only the setup databases and the database snapshot so we do not have any database we can work with so therefore let's head over to our browser and download adventure works 2019 database and then we use the backup technique to restore to our management studio okay i come over to my browser and then i can type in adventure works database and then the first result i click on it so that moves me to this section so i can actually see and scroll down and under this download backup file i can see that we have oltp which simply means online transaction processing workload and we have the data warehouse and the lightweight so because i'm actually using microsoft sql server 2019 i can actually go ahead and download this adventure works 2019.bak file extension which i have done so let's come over to my downloads now in my download i can actually search for it which is this adventure of 2019.bak so what i'm going to do is to control c to copy in memory and then proceed to my windows c drive so in here i'm going to double click on this and then i choose program files so under the program file i have all many files so i'm going to search for microsoft sql server here double click on that and then i double click on this mwsql 15.mwsq server so double click on that and finally i'm going to double click on microsoft sql server and then i have the backup bin data install jobs log and so on so double click on backup and then we can see that the folder is currently empty so what i'm going to do is to paste the adventureworks.2019.bak so control v to paste and then we have it pasted here so we are done with this section so i can proceed to close this backup window for now now let's head over to our management studio to restore the backup okay so now we do not have the adventure works 2019 database yet so what i'm going to do is to from this databases right click and choose restore database and then from the restore we have the source now we have the database and the device now it's actually coming from our device so i'm going to choose device and then we have these three ellipses so i click on that and then we can see the backup media file now we have file and url but this is actually coming from our file so the file is okay and then i click on add now from the add i can actually see the backup file location which is coming from microsoft sql server and then mwsql 15.mwsql server and then i click on this mws ql and under the backup file so you can actually see the file um the extension here so what i'm going to do is to just select it and then i click on ok and then we can see it in the backup media so click on ok and then we can also see it here backup i mean backup set to restore so what i'm going to do is to click on ok to fully restore it into our management studio so i click on that and we can see that it is restoring adventure Wars 2019 full database backup and we can see the progress mm -hmm. so once it gets to 100 percent we can see database adventure Wars 2019 restored successfully so i click on ok and then we have the database here that's awesome now let's quickly you know just get one of the table from the database now what i'm going to do is to you know do expand this and we can see all the myriads of table here okay now what i'm going to do is i can actually just point to the database here so i'm going to choose adventure works 2019 or you can even just say use adventure works 2019 query and execute no problem anyone is fine so we can see all the tables we have the schema name and the table name now let's say we want to fetch the person dot person table so i can use select all you know statements from then i'm going to put the schema name which is person 
then I can put in the dot, then the table name, person, okay? Then I can go ahead and click on execute and bam, we have the results. So we can actually see the results. So this is essentially how we can download and restore AdventureWorks 2019 database into our management studio. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, you can like, comment, share, and consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you and bye for now. Cheers.